Hey, it's Kim from Affordably Crafty. I am here at Goodwill. All of my novelty yarn dreams have been fulfilled. Somebody did a de-stash of, or somebody didn't know what to do with this stuff. Cause it is all mostly high-end LYS yarn. For like 99 cents a thing. Or cheaper, cause I got some in bags. Last time I was at this Goodwill, not Goodwill, Salvation Army, there was not a lot to be had here. But today it's yellow is a dollar and two colors are half off. I got some shorts for myself and some other stuff, but let's turn this around and check out the yarn. Oh, if you're new here, welcome. My channel is all about teaching you how to stretch your craft dollar and be affordably crafty. Please like, share, and subscribe. Also follow me on Instagram and join my Facebook group. I post about all my deals, steals, and freebies I find in my travels in the crafting world. I'm gonna start here with the singletons first. Um, dude, this is amazing. This is some yarn I never heard of before. It's called Iron Stone Yarns from Las Vegas. Uh, anybody ever heard of this brand? Pretty sure it's from an LIS made in France. You don't see that very often, eyelash yarn. 143 yards on this ball. Do not wring my flat to dry. You know, no kudos. No kudos. Flutter, made in Italy, 75 yards, 100 polyester. Oh, look at the metallic. Oh, you know I'm a sucker for some metallic. <gasps> no smoking. Weird name. By Filatura de Crossa. It's going to be made in Italy. I think it's covered up. 83 yards. 66 viscose. 34 polyester. From Sockinet Pearls. Never heard of this place before. Look how pretty that copper is. And we got some pewter. Not a metallic color you see that often. This is Rowan Yarns Lurix Shimmer, 85 viscose, 20 polyester, and I believe all these are full skeins, 495, yeah, probably like 30 years ago. Right? Okay, we've got, oh my god. I want more of this, like, right away. Look at that. Oh my god, I'm in love. 67 acrylic, 12 nylon, 12 metal, 50 grams per ball. Spun in France. How about this craziness? What is that? Made in France by Plymouth Yarns, Salsa Yarn, La Collection Francaise. 212 yards. Oh, 1250, wherever this came from originally. Look how cool that is. Mm. There's ribbon yarn, and then there's what is that? Artful Yarn Showstopper, 92 nylon, 8% metallic. That is crazy. Mm. Made in Italy. Artful Yarns from Townsend, Massachusetts. So I'm going to look that up. Barocco Candy FX. Look how pretty that is. 68 yards, 100% nylon. This needs to be in some Halloween project right away. This is Whimsy from Yellowstone Yarns. How cool that is. Plume FX by Barocco. Prettiness. Uh, 63 yards. And all these so far are 99 cents. Okay, I know that this originally came from, or I've seen it at Job Lot, but I never saw it in this color. This is the color Carnival. God, it's Lion Brand. Okay, now these I have almost more than one of. So this I only have one of. Fiesta Yarns Gelato, original price $22. It is a ribbon yarn, but oh my God, look how pretty that is. And it is 262 yards, 99 cents. And this one is from Classic Elite Yarns, which is an LYS brand. 72 cotton, 17 nylon, 118 yards. Um, this is technically a singleton. However, there's a blue buddy over there that I'll show you in a minute in one of the bags. I think I'm going to end up with five or six of these in the same color. Trendsetter Yarns Sorbet. Trendsetter Yarns is again a high-end brand. Mm, made in France. How many yards is this? Hold on. So it says plus minus 55 yards. I don't know what that means, but look how pretty that is. I've got one, two, three, probably five, because I have two in the bag over there, I believe. And then I think I have four in this color, which is the same exact yarn. Then there's this stuff. Garn Grow Bordel Hamburg Oriental. 
Again, from this place called Sockinet Pearls originally. Look at the little flat flecks of gold in there. What? 55 meters, I have two of those. Trellis yarn by Lion Brand in this nice blue color. And that is 115 yards. I have two of those. Mosaic FX by Barocco. Two of those. Dazzle yarn by something made in Italy. I don't know, two of those. Two of these in this color. Look at the freaking metallic and the neutrals on this. Tango by Plymouth Yarns, 34 cotton, 36 acrylic, 30% polyamide. And it's about 74 yards, two of those and one in this, but I totally think I could blend those together. What do you guys think? Oh, check out this awesome copper, black, and uh, like uh, royal blue metallic. This is called Flutter Yarn by who knows. Got two of those. Two colors of this. This is again from Yellowstone Yarns. This is called Desert Flower. So I have this grays and gold. And then look at these pinks and purples. And then over here, these are more trellis yarns, but in different colors. That, I mean, I think I could mix those together though. What do you guys think? This is the color rainbow. And the color, where am I? The color name is, it's covered. Okay, I am gonna put these back because they're just not calling to me. Those are kind of boring. All right, now the bags. So the bags are $3.99 each. Look, there's another one of a match of this one. Look at this one. This is by Taki Yarns. That's expensive. I don't know who that's by, but that is pretty. That, not sure. Eyelash something or other. And then I'm just sucking up the fun fur because I like the other stuff. There's not a whole lot in here, but I could use it as an accent piece or something. Two of these Katia chicks in the same color. This one is Juliet yarn by who knows who. That looks like another Barocco yarn. What is this tiny thing? Can't say. Candy color by Osterman. That's a ribbon yarn. And then one of my favorite vintage yarns is in here. That's mo uh, mohair, Moonlight Mohair. So I have more of these colors at home, but the real reason I'm grabbing this is look at this mohair with these green and purple metallics. I can't really tell because it's still in the bag, but oh my God. Okay, check this out. <gasps> look at those sequins, guys. And then look, this eyelash with a copper. This guy. This thing right here is like looking amazing with that multicolor copper. And this is... That's Metallic FX by Barocco. <gasps> Dude, there's two of those. Those are amazing. Last bag. So I have another one of these guys here, bringing me to three. This may match this. Metallic FX. Metallic FX. So these are the same yarn by Barocco. This one and this guy. This is the blue twinsy to this black. Can definitely pair those together. Okay, there's 100% moisturized cotton in here. I have more of this in balls at home that I can pair together. What is this one? Plymouth Yarns Patches. Isn't that cool looking? And then we've got a eyelash something or other. What is this? Oh, a flutter. Is that the same one? A flip, guys. Yep, so that gives me two flutters. Okay, what do you guys think? Oh, what's your favorite yarn? Does novelty yarn scare the crap out of you? Please like, share, and subscribe so your friends can learn to be affordably crafty too and have a creative day, everyone. Bye-bye.